We love when women make history, and today it is my honor to take you inside Talea, the first ever female-owned brewery of its kind in New York City. Tell me how you got interested in beer. Where did it all begin? Right out of college, I served in the Navy. I was fortunate enough to be stationed in San Diego and Hawaii. San Diego is an IPA mecca, and that's where I fell in love with beer. After the Navy, I pursued a career in corporate finance, but could never really get beer off my mind. So I decided to join a startup called Hopsy to learn more about the beer industry. That brought me to New York City and eventually to Sarah, where we decided to create Tilia together. I was really interested in wine, and during business school at NYU, I did a lot of wine-related projects, including spending a summer working at Wolfer Estate. And for me, that sparked a desire to create that same experience, but in the beer world, because as few women as there are in wine, there are even fewer in beer. So I started homebrewing and eventually was able to convince myself to leave my corporate career behind and join Leanne at Hopsy, where he realized that we had a shared vision to create a new type of brewery that could elevate the beer experience and include women in their customer set. What we believe is there are many people out there who haven't had a good reason to try craft beer in the last few years. Maybe they think it's all very bland or it's super bitter. So we are trying to tap into a whole new market, an entirely new experience, both in the tap room and just what's presented with our cans. As you can see, we wanted to make sure people were aware this is a production facility. So from the main entrance in the retail space, you can peek into our brewery. Wow. So these are our fermenters, our unit tanks. So each one of these full will weigh around 15,000 pounds. It carries about 40 barrels of beer, which is 80 keg stand kegs. <laughs> <laughs> this is our brew house. We've brewed six beers here so far in the last month. How much beer do you think you have in here? Probably 80 to 100 barrels were. The most traditional format for a craft brewery is the half barrel size. But for us, when we started the company and we started selling beer two years ago, Leanne and I did all the sales and deliveries ourselves. This weighs 160 pounds and we could barely, with the two of us, get it onto a truck, much less into the basement of a bar in the Lower East Side. So we switched to only selling the smaller kegs in distribution. So that means we can hire anyone who can lift 50 pounds versus 160 pounds. Beer delivery is traditionally an entry level role, so it opens up the pool of candidates so we can hire women or people who don't regularly weightlift to deliver the beer and hopefully get their start in a career in beer. So we have made it to the beautiful tap room and we have quite a colorful spread here. How many beers do you serve? We have about 13 on tap right now. Almost all hazy IPAs and fruited sours like you see here. And it doesn't stop here at colorful beers. You also have colorful cocktails. Yes, so we have three cocktails. In front of you, you have a gin crush. You also have the Talea punch and we have the Talea Bellini. It smells so good. I like how you have the flights I like how you have a nice variety of things on the plate too. It's fun, I would do this with my girlfriends, anyone that wants, who wants to come with me? Cause we're coming back. <laughs>